Okay, I'm going to show everybody quick how to use uh, the Netflix DNS numbers for going online with your PS3 to go on to US Netflix. So first off, you want to, you know, go over to your settings and then go all the way down to network settings. Okay. Now you go down to internet connection settings and press your X. It'll log you out or whatever to do it. Okay, now it's going to say easier custom. Go down to custom and then move over to the next part. Okay, depending if you're wired or wireless. You know, it'll be about the same thing. I'm going to do wireless because a lot of people do it wirelessly. Go over. Now you try to find your um, area. You can scan normally on this first to find your connection of where you're going to hook your internet to. Mine set for slick or whatever. So I'll just X to enter and then I just move over because everything's going to be the same okay and there's no security on it now for IP address you can leave as automatic and go next and you can leave DHCP to do not set okay now for DNS settings go down to manual which is already on manual go over to the right now as you can see <coughs> I already have the numbers in there already of the ones that I'm using at this moment all you do to click on each one, you click edit, and then you can just scroll up and down to whatever number you want. And then you just enter again, and then you can go to the next one for secondary. And then see, you just push to the right when you're done. Just keep that automatic. Yeah, do not use proxy server. Enable UPnP. So now it's all ready to go. And then you can see that uh, the DNS numbers are in there that you already set. And then you can X enter and then they'll do a little test connection. They'll make sure that, uh, yeah, got success for internet IP, internet connection. Just scrolling down a little bit. Okay, PSN connects. Available, available, checking speed connection. Takes a little, you know, a few seconds to get this to go down. Okay, so I mean, the connection's a little slow, but it's just this time of day, it's always like that. And then you just click back. And then you go and it'll usually connect automatically, or you just go to Netflix. It'll ask to sign in, or it'll sign in before you get there. It's one of those things. Okay. Uh, it just takes a second to get into Netflix, just like normal on a PS3. Okay, and there you go. And just so you guys know, MacGyver is only on the US Netflix because I had it on the went to Canadian one and you can't watch it and and there you go. It'll connect and there you go. As you can see it's working. So there's a little demonstration of how that works. But like I said before, you have to make sure that you have Netflix already or it's not going to work. It, this doesn't give you free Netflix. This just gives you a choice between Canadian and US Netflix. The US Netflix does have a lot more choices but you know there's a lot of Canadian shows that you're not going to get on the US one either so you just kind of check back and forth. If you want to go back to Canadian you just take the DNS numbers out and go into your internet normally that's how you can go back and forth so every time you want to go to US you just do this or 
you just make sure that you um, if you have two systems or something else you just leave one Canadian one this way you know it's either way well I hope this helps you guys out and uh, it's pretty easy to get this done so anyways take care and have a good day